this is interesting because you shake your soul out of her uh, chest glands. Hello friends, today I'm at Westbury Antique Mall in Bloomington, Indiana. I'm excited, I haven't been in here for a while, so let's go in and see what we can find today. So this is really cute. It says it's Koto marked Japan blue floral. It's sixteen dollars for like the little, almost like a, it's like a jack in the pulpit kind of style vase. There's the mark on the bottom with this really pretty planter with these like blue bells. But let me look on this. See, this got a little bit of a hairline right there. So listen for this sound. You you can hear like a dull thud. That's not a sound that I want to hear, and it makes me nervous to ship things that have that sound. So I'm going to pass on that, even though it's really cute. I do not like shipping plates. They just make me nervous because they're vulnerable. But look at these. These are $8 for a set of, wait, $8 for a set of four for 30 But those are pretty cool. They're marked USA on the bottom. Pretty neat. I'm not going to get them, but could you imagine going to a dinner and there's, you know, I, I mean, I think it's like a serving, like maybe for, I don't know, for shrimp. I don't know. These are the dipping sauces. I don't know. I don't eat seafood, so I don't know, but they're still kind of fun. What you dreaming about? Oh, I don't know. Oh, me either. I love this section. Let's see. Ooh, the Greater Jello recipe book. How much is this? 450. Might have to get that. I like the colors on it. That's the first thing we put in our cart. All right, I'm currently obsessed with these alabaster eggs and I'm going to get some. I love them. It's 850. For, so I'm going to get some of these bright colored ones. This one's 10. And this one's funny. Or funny. It's not funny. It's pretty. Uh, I just like the bright colored ones. This one's five. I love them. This one's pretty big for nine fifty. This big, like purpley one. They look like little marbled eggs. See, I just got the colorful ones. I feel bad because I kind of love. I don't, I don't. It's blue one. It's eight dollars. I don't know. I just like the pastel colored ones. I kind of left the plain ones. I'm gonna get these two. These cute. They're eight fifty for the little birds. They're salt and pepper shakers, but I like they're very spring and fun, so I'm going to get these little guys too. I am Johnny on the spot. It's cute. Oh, look, here's a little, little Willy Wire hand. And this cookbook. <laughs> I love the anthropomorphic thing. Look at the four little bunnies in clothes. It's from 1935. It is $10, but my goodness. So this is Mrs. White Rabbit. How'd they get these, these, these bunnies to do this? It's pretty amazing. Here we have single shakers for a dollar each. Is that a monkey? A monkey lady? I think so. Oh my goodness, look at the little worm! Oh my gosh. He's adorable. He's a dollar. I'm going to get you, little worm. What else have we got in here? Goosey. Um, you're a pheasant. Pink chicken and some peppers. Who are you? Are you a little bug? No, you're like a little, like a little elf guy. It's a little shell. And this is a little flower. Well, and a lampshade. But oh my gosh, we're going to get a little wormy. Well, here we go. Here's Bill Dances. He's the bass champ. He doesn't look like a bass champ, though. That's all, That must be him on a Monday. He only fishes on the weekends. But he'll tell you all there is to know about fishing. Because he is the bass champ. Okay, I absolutely love this. It's for your pleasure. They are, it's a book of uh, cinema lobby cards. It's $10, but my goodness gracious. Look at the Lon Chaney. I mean, these could be framed. Taken out of here and framed. Catherine Hepburn, Marlene Dietrich, and Gary Cooper. 
So I think I'm gonna get this. Oh my God, there's May. I love May West. Okay, I'm gonna get this. I love it. I love it, love it, love it. But this is a really neat box, the American Red Cross. You, um, it's $60. Oh, I love that. I would have that in my house. That's not a bad price for it too. I love that. Hey, booth 857 is a booth that I really like. Let's see what she's got today. Here's a little bunny in here. Oh, it's a little nightlight. Well, that's cute. For $9.95, a little bunny nightlight. Cute. Peter playing his accordion. She always changes things up in here, too. It always looks so nice. It's a little glass bird. Oh, no, I get... Well, you're ceramic. Oh, here's a little boy. Little boy. You are Price Imports. He's an April boy. He's a little chill. Well, I don't know if that... Almost looks like he's got a little bit of paint on him. He's a really cute little guy. All right, so here's a pig planter, and you can hear it's more high pitched than another one was like a dull. It was a dull sound. This little Friggy Pyrex for $19.95. This is a lot going on here. It's a boot, but it looks like all this like sea life on it. Hmm. Different. Look, he's just being born. Like these Libby circus glasses are really pretty epic. It's fifty dollars for the set of five of them, with the elephants on here, and it's got like the the elephant girl. I don't know what she's called, but she's in the trunk. There are no clowns on these cups, so I approve. Here is something kind of fun. This is this is it's eight ninety nine for this um, jellyfish paperweight with the stand brass stand so I think I'm definitely gonna get that that um, brutalist sailboats pretty neat too for 22 I did like this little bird here for $8.99 but his little eye is missing on the other side so I'm gonna leave him behind but we are gonna get this oh no I like this globe it's a J Chen globe it's $20 which is not a bad price I don't I'm not, I'm not, it's a great price though, but I'm not going to do it today. I'm going to walk away from the globe. It's getting a little ridiculous, but I just love them so much. Quick three, there's another globe down there. These are fun, these little rotan Rafi Aware, $19 for the set of six of them. It'd be great for a little picnic party on your patio. Well, this little drum bank is $8. And it is made in Hong Kong, but I think it'd be kind of cute for a 4th of July display. Put a little something on top of there. Hmm. Maybe. This booth usually has a lot of cool things. This is Royal Ducks. That it is $51. It's a stylized swan. So I'm going to have to see if Michael needs this. Got grandpa, mom, and dad. These are Dryden. How much are they? Um, $15.40. Oh, just the dad is $15.40. So they're $15.40 each. And then this is Black Navajo round pottery vase this is gorgeous the way that this is done oh my gosh that's beautiful it's 1660 beauty you know something as simple it's just these number two pencils in this that just looks cool so i like this display this is a neat booth she always has it displayed so nicely see use the use of books oh my gosh look at this hat Oh, I love that hat. I wish I could wear hats like that. Here, let's try it on. Not working for me. No. Nope. They made hats for littler people, I think, back in the day. Oh, no, that's ceramic. I was like, oh, there's another alabaster egg for two seventy five, but that one is ceramic. The green cell dog spaniel for twenty four, the peacock for twenty eight. But I was looking down here. 
These are these little farm kids. They're $9.99. Look at her and her little pitchfork. They are made by Inesco. So I think I'm going to get them. I think that they are adorable. This is interesting too. This duck is giving this bunny a ride. Bunny on duck, single shaker for $5. It's different. It's a cute book here. Well, first of all, these are adorable. These Japan little um, soldiers. The War of the Wooden Soldiers. What a neat book. And it looks cute with those little soldiers. It's $6. I think I'm going to get them. And I might sell them together because I think that is an adorable display right there. Another adorable salt and pepper shaker family. They're a blended family, clearly. But they're salt and pepper shakers. Just these two come off, and this the mama doesn't, but those are pretty cute. All right, I'm gonna get those as well. Adorable. Well, this is interesting because you shake your salt out of her uh, chest glands, those are different. <laughs> Venus to Milo, 1250. Do you shake them out of her chest glands? You sure do. Those are different. I think I might have to get those. Also, these cute little tiger cat salt and pepper shakers. They are $7.50. I'm going to grab those. And I know you guys are already seeing it. It is $34. This is Leo Ward, 1993. It's the sparrow with the open wings. It's $34. I am going to get them, though. I love these with the wings open. They're not as easy to find as the regular bluebirds of happiness so i'm gonna get this guy These little nuts are they supposed to be strawberries um persimmons maybe i don't know what are these little guys they're six dollars oh wait your little head comes off what's going on they're made in thailand lacquer owl container yeah look his little head you can store things inside his body there's his big brother. You can do the same to him. He's $19.99. Fun. And then I think this is supposed to have, maybe not, but I think that's supposed to have a little bug on top of it. And boop, boop, boop. A whole Howard. Monkey with a hat on. Here's for $4.50. There's seven pairs of novelty salt and pepper shakers. I see a ball, and a mitt, a telephone, a horse, and a horseshoe, and then toothbrush and toothpaste. So I'm going to get this for $4.50. Right, I think I'm also going to get this um, mint green sewing box with the contents. Yeah, I love that. That's a great look. So that's $12.50, so I'm going to get that as well. Although here's the little taxi that hurried. Good job, little taxi. This is an older one. There's no barcode on it. Six. I'm not going to get it, but I like that he's hurrying. That's a good business practice to hurry, little little taxi. Little Tanala Duck. See, that's retro. I don't think that this is old. No, that's a repro reproduction, but I'm looking for spacey things for my displays with my spaceman. You're cute. Tanala Mexican Folk Art Pottery. You're different. Are you Mark Tanala? I tend to just buy the Ken Edwards ones, but I don't think I'm going to get that. But I like, oops, I like that he's got a little quilted back on him. What is this? I like you, Roseville. You're Iris. You are a wishing well. Vintage Japan planter wishing well. Oh, that's neat. The San Antonio, Texas plate. And I like how this booth uses record albums to use as some of their wall art. I think that's a really neat idea. Bitter, beautiful, bittersweet. Ellie Smith face for 69 It's pretty fabulous. I love this booth. This is a beautiful piece of English pottery and I love that it's discolored. And it's been used. It is $13.50. I'm in love with it. It does have a hairline right here. But I am going to take it home and I'm going to keep it. Here's the bottom of it. What did it say it was? It was Art Deco style pitcher. Green. Cornishire. 
um, England, but I'm going to get that and I'm going to keep it. We got babies down here. What is this? Hey, 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 I'm a Cosby kid. Oh, your pants need pulled up. That's odd. $20, 1985. Okay. Sorry about but sorry about that, buddy. This is a beautiful Fenton butt vase. I'm not sure the pattern. Lily, I don't know, but it does glow. It is embossed Fenton, so it's after 1971, but $19 isn't a bad price. So I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I won't. Maybe I won't. I gotta be a little bit more picky, but here we go. Here's some sheet music. You know, does your heart beat for me? No. Oh, it was the night before Christmas. I think I have enough Christmas ones, but I just, I already have that one too. I bought Hollywood Canteen, the Happy Whistler. Love me to pieces. And, I mean, we, we might as well look raun raunchy. Raunchy. Those of you that got married in the 90s, who else had these in their wedding? I did. That kind of looks like Elvis. Man in the moon. Do Am I seeing, I mean, do you think so? Let me know. Do you think that looks like Elvis? I think it does. Oh, look, Anne. It's Teddy. Teddy. What do you think Mark would say if I came home with a trumpet? plastic too. That's the weird thing. This is like a, it's a toy that really plays. It's $25. It's pretty cool. Oh my goodness. Suck it to me. This is a lap-in trash can. Oh my gosh. That's amazing. That's amazing. It's $28. Ay, ay, ay. She looks like she's got a lot to say. Antique original oil painting portrait of a woman. A New England artist. $695. She's got a lot to say. Oh, here, look at you, little fella. You're cute, little pixie figure. And your little blue cloak. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to get you, but you're awfully cute. I sold that before, but hoof. It's a made out of hooves from a bovine animal of some sort. They're almost done with the upstairs. We're going to be heading downstairs here in a few minutes. Let's see what we can find down there. I just got downstairs and I found this cute little bunny. It's $15. I think it's adorable. A little art glass bunny. So I put that in my cart. And we just got downstairs. Oh my goodness, oh my goodness, look at you. You are made by Ukago. You're bisque, but you're, this one's sassy. That one's super sassy. I don't think I'm gonna get them, but, well, I don't know. The flowers seem to be pretty good, but I don't know. I just don't like the way they feel. Eh. Sorry, but you're cute, but I just don't like the way you feel. This is pretty. Four ninety five, a little egg. Oh, look at you, silly bunny. All right. Well, let's see what else we can find on these here. Oops, my cart on these here. <gasps> we found Rimpal. Well, it's Diamond Studio, Diamond Pottery, but it is supposed to be a Rimpal horse. Frisky, $16 for this guy. I can't resist them. I just want to make sure that he's not, he doesn't have any boobers on him, but he's a big one too. Well, this, this guy is a lot of fun. He is $28. I have one similar to him, but he's a little bank. Very cute. Looks cute on this table, which is very delicious. I love that color. Oh, my grandpa had those on his truck. No, I think he, well, I don't know if he had those or if he had Yosemite Sam. He had one of the two. Well, look at you, Trisha. Trisha in your pink pants. And look, there's Barb in 1987. My goodness, look at him. He's got his stereo headphones set on. He's snazzy. These are kind of neat, too. They're just that, um, hey, what is this hospital?
hospital booze? The fun way to serve any brew? You put it like an IV. I don't understand. Okay, it's a personalized decanter. That's what that is. Well, that's fun. But these are like little Big Ten coasters. Wisconsin, Iowa, Ohio. Look at me. I'm kind of impressed that I know those. Oh, it says Happy Thanksgiving. Oh, it's a candle with Ziggy on it. <laughs> That's just cracking me up. All right. Oh, this is... Oh, look at... Oh, wait, wait. What is this? That's $20. That is fabulous. Wait, it doesn't stand up, does it? Wait, what's going... What's... Wait, what is this wire for? I don't understand what that wire is for. I would like for it to, like, hang in my window with a naked girl on it. I don't know what how it's supposed to sit. I know, it's pretty cool, though. I do like it. There's a head. I have to talk continuously because of the music, but holy tamole, that's the biggest empoli I've ever seen. $12? I mean, how can I not get that? But, lordy, I don't want to ship that. But it's $12. That probably has to be 16 inches tall. That is epic. This is 15, which is more money than that, but this is more manageable to me. But I like how it has the fingers on it. I don't know. So I am going to get this. This is a fun and bright booth with full of fun mid century modern pieces. All right, so let's see. This is beautiful. This Empoli, this twisted, how much is that? $38 for that. These are pretty too. $38 for the, I think for the set. Yeah. I'd say these might be Blanco. $19.99 for those. And ooh, that's a cool chair in Ottoman. They've just got fun stuff. Look at those bar trays. Oh, these are fun. $5. Little TV, wooden TV. This is for tobacco. Oh, no, it's not. They are individual ashtrays. Or coasters. There's no divots for a cigarette. Monogram coasters, yeah. With walnut caddy. If you've got a name, if your name is B, that is pretty. That's swanky. Isn't this cute? It's a little bird. A mama bird feeding her babies. How much is this? It is $34. Well, that is stinking adorable. Adorable. I did find a little bluebird for, well, this one is Ron Ray, 1995. It's in great condition for $7.99, so that's a great deal. I did see this, too, but I'm not going to get it, but it's a little treasure craft pixie. I don't know. I just, he's brown. I just, I don't, he's brown. Pays $15, 1961, so I'm going to leave him behind because he's, he's brown. I still think these are the weirdest things ever. It's Dwight and Mamie Eisenhower mugs. They're $75. I, that's just bizarre to me. I don't, I don't understand, but whatever. They've been here for a long time though, but it's just a very very different thing. I mean, you could put a pellant up in his head or you could drink your coffee out of him. It's just odd. Well, I had, I had a great time here at Westbury Antique Mall. It's a fun place. Make sure that you do come in and you, and you pay my visit. It's right off Highway 37 here in Bloomington, Indiana. A really great place to come in and shop. Everything that I did purchase, you did see me pick up. So if there's anything that you might be interested in, you can send me an email, thrifterjunkervintagehunter at gmail.com, and I'll let you know if it is available now or if it will be available in an upcoming live sale. So now I'm going to go home and unpack all my treasures. It's so much fun. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Red hot mama, red hot mama, you're the one.